Hi everyone, my name is Lauren Pascarella and I'm a mortgage loan officer with Fairway Funding Group. My name is Kevin Tai, broker associate with Bright Realty, team leader of Tai Properties Group. And we are your friends in real estate. And today we had a few different topics that we wanted to talk about. But first, uh, I want to talk about first time home buyers and how usually people are trying to figure out what they want in a home and going through all these specifics. But in reality, it's not going to be their forever home nine times out of 10, right, Kevin? Yeah, exactly. Yeah. So, and talking about first time home buyer, and most of them, uh, maybe coming from renting a property right mm -hmm. so in this video right here i want to show you guys some information about you know rent uh this video actually show from 1988 um you know to last year 2022 and rent has been continued going up since 1988 you know mm -hmm. never a time that the rent come down which is makes sense we don't really hear from our landlord say hey you know what <laughs> this year renew we're gonna drop 500s on your lease, that would you know, be nice. <laughs> right? We don't hear that. We always hear that, you know, there will be a 2%, 5%. And last year, even we see somebody have a 10% mm -hmm. increase on their rent. So, um, so that's actually telling us, you know, when you are renting, you're actually paying somebody else instead of paying yourself. Yeah. And um, number two point that I'm going to talk about is according to the research in the U.S., um, on the average, homeowners, um, they have a net worth of 255000 And comparing with people who are renting a home, mm -hmm. the average, you know, the net worth is 6300 So we can see a difference about home ownership, how it can help people to build wealth and also, you know, go into that financial freedom Absolutely. for their future. And number three is like the hot topic right now, we have the inflation and real estate is actually a good hedge for inflation. And, and also according to the research for everybody out there, 73% um, 70, of property manager and landlords mm -hmm. are talking about they going to raise rent again next year. Yeah. So, you know, like even though some people are thinking about, you know what, oh, you know, economy, we're not sure how it go. Maybe things will get more affordable but definitely not rent. It's a never ending cycle. And a lot of people I talk to have been talking about how their rent is continuously increasing. They don't know what to expect. Mm -hmm. I mean, they're really paying their landlord's mortgage when you think about it, they're not paying their own. So if you're paying your own mortgage, mm -hmm. you're starting to build that wealth, build that equity, and you know that your payment is never gonna change. The most common program right now is the 30 year mm -hmm. fix. So you know what your monthly payment is gonna right. be for a very, very long time. And that is one of the main reasons why people should look into buying a home. Exactly, right? I mean, like, it made me think about, like, the first home that um, I bought, you know, like, the payment is, like, 1500 mm -hmm. And if I still live in that house, I still pay 1500 a month yeah. on my mortgage. And part of that money actually come back to me. Exactly. So, you yeah. know, like, so home ownership do have... Um, you know, benefit for people, yeah. Yeah, mm -hmm. and if you look at the data, you'll see that your home is going to, the value is gonna to continue to increase. It doesn't just level out. So you are gonna be making money on your investment and it'll be worthwhile when you go and sell that home and buy another one. Right, exactly. So hopefully you guys are focusing on the long terms. Yeah, exactly. So mm -hmm. first time home buyers, don't be scared to get out there and start looking. You may have to make some uh, things like a bathroom you may want, but may not be there, but you would, be happy that you bought a home in the first place and you can find one in the future with all of the things you're looking for. Right. And feel free to reach out to us. We'll help you we'll like, you know, like during the process and also do your research for you and make sure that you know, you're actually um, buying a home within your budget so exactly. you are not feeling stressed. Like, yep. oh my God, I got to make a payment, <laughs> you know, stuff like that. So you don't have that stress. We'll help you to plan and see you know, how your financial is and Lauren can help you with the mortgage. Exactly. Yeah. We want to make sure you're uh, getting into something that you can afford. And the nice thing about first time home buyers is you can have minimal down payments. You can have people um, gift you funds for closing for a down payment. So that can help you out there. There's many different options and routes that we can take and we will be happy to help you with your first home purchase. All right. Thank you so much. Thank you. Mm -hmm.